Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm back with another top 10 Minecraft mods for 1.7.10. If any of these mods catch your eye, be sure to check them out in the description below. And anyways, let's go ahead and get into the mods. At number 10, we have the 3D Blocks mod. This mod, as you can see, makes it so all blocks that are normally two-dimensional are 3D now. Just be sure when you're using this mod to keep in mind that if you look at all of these blocks from a certain angle, you'll get a strange distortion effect. So if this will bug you, then this probably isn't the mod for you. At number 9, we have the Why You No Make Good Map mod. Just ignore the name. This mod's actually very helpful, and if you like building, it'll make it so you can start on a new world that has nothing on it except one block, so you don't fall and die, and so you can actually place blocks. But this is very helpful for people that like to uh, build on worlds that have nothing on them. At number 8, we have the Dynamic Lights mod. This mod makes it so all glowing items will now glow in your hand, and this is very helpful for those of you that don't like to place a lot of torches, and this mod can also be configured to make it so things such as armor will glow too. At number 7, we have the Item Physic mod, and as you can see, this mod makes it so items that are thrown out of your inventory under the ground now render simply as they would if you were actually to throw something on the ground. No longer do you have strange spinning objects in the game. At number 6 we have the Better PvP mod. This mod comes with a bunch of features including a mini-map. You can see how much durability your stuff has left, and it's also very configurable so if you don't like where something's positioned on your screen you can just move it around somewhere else. At number 5 we have Balkan's Weapon mod. This mod, as you could probably tell from the title, adds a bunch of new weapons to the game. Some of them are throwable, some of them hit faster, some of them shoot, and they're all in all very helpful while you're playing and it just gives you a nice wide variety of new weapons and also gives you some pretty cool dummies to attack. At number 4 we have the Atom mod. It could be pronounced Atom, I honestly have no idea. But anyways, this mod adds a new dimension to the game in which you can see nothing, adds a bunch of new enemies to the game, and also some cool things to explore such as pyramids, and they're pretty fun to explore considering you get to fight a pretty tough enemy in the end and get some pretty cool stuff from him. At number 3 we have the smart moving mod, and as you can see it adds some new animations to the game such as flying and swimming. This mod makes uh, getting around a lot easier too, as you can do things such as crawling, uh, wall jumping, and just a lot of other new features that are pretty cool. At number 2 we have Flans mod, and as you can see this mod adds some robots and very big robots to the game. You can also get things that allow you to fly around, such as the spaceship here. And this mod actually does not come with any content and you have to install packs, but there are many packs you can download. Some of them even have weapons, so really you can customize it as much as you want. Finally, at number 1 we have the World Edit mod, and it's kind of a toss up between this and number 2, although I had to go with this one just because of how helpful it is to those of you that like to build. What would normally take you hours, you can do in minutes, as you can simply command the game to place thousands of blocks for you, and this is an incredibly helpful tool for those of you that like to build large scale maps. Well, that is it for this video. If you believe I missed out on a mod, tell me down in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe. And until next time, thanks for watching. <laughs>